내가 George with the ball. Shaq with a screen on Anderson. Trying to get open is Shaq. Plays it up off the glass. Shaq's got five points now this quarter. Because Shaquille O'Neal is so big and so athletic and so relentless, it's really hard to keep him off the glass. Now here's Stoudemire. Outside for Randolph. Spins. And slam dunk by Randolph. Yeah, that, that's careless defense, though. I mean, he's one player you can ill afford to let run free. He just loves to be a money player in the fourth quarter. Yeah, I agree with you, Greg. I mean, he plays with no fear, and he certainly knows how to put the ball in the basket. Here's Fisher. The Blazers getting the bucket. Clock at four. He takes it in. And that one, good. Fisher's got 10 points in just the second half. Nice strength and focus from Fisher that time because he got hit on that shot. It's Pippen on the win. Guarded by Walker. Too long in the paint. He's hit with a three-second violation. All right, well, look at how the hustle game has been going for Los Angeles. They have been a wrecking ball defensively coming up with steals being active with their hands and just doing a terrific job of disrupting the rhythm and you know on top of that second chance points have been a major component for them and I love the relentlessness they've shown on the offensive glass catching up on the changes for Los Angeles or is check in for one Rush comes in for Fox Kobe's check in for George Shaw subbed in for Fisher. Yeah, that's a tough call right there and, and really a tough break for the D. No problem for me with that call. I mean, he was still sliding right there. Now Kobe, Scotty Pippen missing from long range, has to rush. From 13. That is exactly the effort you love seeing from Randolph. Wanting to make a difference and putting his handprints on this game. Oh, I love watching him flush it home, showing how easily he can get off the ground and bang it. Pass to Daniels. To the middle. Here's Randolph and slam dunk by Randolph. He has been in these situations before, fellas. Not phased at all by the pressure. On the wing, Kobe. O'Neal sets the screen for Kobe. They double-team Kobe. Stolen by Randolph. And they're running. Here's Patterson. Outside Pippen. It's picked off. Pass to Kobe. A baseline jam. And he hits the jump shot. Ryan's got 12 points in just the second half. Kobe thrives under pressure when his team needs a hoop. He's the man to get it for. Pippen, the pass to Daniels. And you know that's going to be goaltending, guys. So that's a free basket right there. Just barely too late and, and catches it on the way down. He's already in the air there, committed. So can't fault him for going for the block. Now Bryant. Orius Green on Patterson. A 15-footer, and they will call over the back on the play. And he drew that call by establishing his base early and then doing a great job with the box out. Yeah, there are a lot of things that go into rebounding, guys. You need strength, you need positioning, but I think timing and a nose for the ball, most important. And I think you're right. That's what got him that call, his physicality and strength. This is what makes him special, his ability to come through in these spots. O'Neal sets the screen for Bryant. Oh, the agility and finish of Kobe Bryant. This just proves how tough Kobe is. Rushing off the defense inside, but no Bryant. The pass to Randall. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. 
Jack's got 13 rebounds in the game. Seeding. Back to Bryant. Kobe draws it up. Outside, O'Neal. Nice passing here by Los Angeles. Six to shoot. Here's Kobe. Again, Los Angeles. He's such a clutch shooter. He just lives for the big shot. Trail Blazers, trail by three. Stoudemire gets to Daniels. Randolph in the posts. Here's Stoudemire. Oh, they get it back. And another shot. Nice timing on that rejection from Chet. Demonstrating why. You gotta take him seriously as a defensive player when he's lurking near the bucket inside. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Pass to Stoudemire. Daniels dishes to Randolph. And stolen by Ori. Bryant attacking. O'Neal passes to Bryant. Screen by O'Neal. Beyond the arc. And Kobe Bryant gets the three. Kobe's got 39. Coming through when it matters most. Kobe thrives under pressure. Now a timeout called by Portland. They trail by six. 24 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Side, Randolph. Yes! And now they trail by just four. Randolph relishes delivering in these moments. Coming up in the clutch is what he does. Hey, you know what? Smart foul. You got to try and extend the game. Do it. It's not over. The clock is as much a problem for them as the score is right now, so they've got to try to manage it. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a six-point ball game. Job well done at the line on that possession. They'll make things a little easier on themselves if they can convert those. Now a timeout called by Portland. They're behind by six. There's 18 seconds left in the game. Stoudemire, right side. Three-pointer, Daniels. Offensive rebound. Randolph kicks to Stoudemire. Offline with his three. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Gets the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. And, you know, George is really one of those reliable role players. He's a good defender also knows how to pick his spots on offense. Five seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Here's Stoudemire. And so the Lakers take the win. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the first step in becoming a good team is your ability to win at home. And they really seem to revel in that opportunity. And, and this is what they came out to do. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. So long and good night, everyone.